Ten years. Great last homie. What's up, baby? What's up, guys? Good to see you. I can't believe it. Toes to the pavement, bro. <laughs> I committed a crime. I shot somebody that shouldn't have been shot, and I was sentenced to prison for 10 years, and I had to do every single day under Measure 11. You, you got two choices. You either change your life or you don't. I'm in a motorcycle club by the name of uh, Gorilla Gospel, and uh, our mission is to fix our wrongdoings and push each other to, uh, to our limits and to make us better men for the world. I want to prove people I'm not just some dumb idiot convict. I'm, you know, I'm a, I'm a smart, educated person, and uh, I applied for the University of Oregon, and within a few weeks I was uh, accepted. I applied for the uh, Lundquist School of Business Honors Program, uh, and I got in. If somebody hears about the success that I have had and that I've been in the same spot that they have been, I'm hoping that's going to motivate somebody because they're going to be like, oh my God, this person, I remember him, or oh my God, this person's life is just like mine. You know what? If he changed, I can't. And uh, it's hard. It's uh, <laughs> uh Nobody likes to be a failure. Nobody likes uh, uh, to look be looked down upon. And uh, I think that's my biggest fear is, is I don't want to be looked down upon. I want to be looked at as an equal. And that's one of the things is best about Guerrilla Gospel is this, they were there when I was at, at my highest. They were with me when I was at my lowest. And now that I'm rising back to the top, they're still with me. And even just, a few ex-cons. We raised over 10,000 books the very first time to give back to inmates, to help inmates, you know, better themselves and hopefully, you know, realize that there's something else out there in life because we gave them nonfiction. We gave them educational books that they can learn and grow off of. Uh, that is our mission is just to, to educate people and realize that it doesn't have to be like that no more. You get a change and you get a second chance at life, so take advantage of it. And if you're willing to do it, you can do it, and it, and it can grow from there. Hurting cattle. <laughs> hey, gorillas at graduation. Out here doing a big for tone only. It is a fiasco, just like it looks. We make a living by what we get, but we make a life by what we give. You are privileged individuals. You graduated from an outstanding institution with a valuable degree. With that privilege comes responsibility. My hope is that you will commit yourselves to finding great success, not only in the workplace, but also in your personal lives. Thomas Tony A. Robinson. Yeah! Up to them, to them, you'll never hear my voice in song. 
Every nigga I been with and took a couple of them Ain't nothing worse than a real G becoming a sucker If you a G, you need to be leaving it on the pavement Get in or get out of the game and stop playing Cause you ain't built for this You know Maniac low, he be coming with that realest shit You got to feel this shit, it's three places you can't get paid That's jail in the hospital or in the grave So while I'm living, man, I got to stay paid Until they lock me up while I'm chilling on my last day I learned to take an ass whooping and learned to give it back They ain't seen no paperwork and they call me a rat But listen, homie, that coat don't fit I'm task maniac, bloke, and I ain't told on shit Tell them What don't kill you will make you stronger